So he has to take a morale check, minus one. He already took a wound. He already took a wound? Yeah, so he's oh, on the he one fell, that's right. Oh, so I really could have killed him. No, that sucks. <laughs> so he has to take a morale check, minus, or morale check, <coughs> minus one. So his morale is eight, I believe. Yes. So seven or less. <gasps> oh, oh, you make it. <laughs> oh, there. All right. So right my recruiter's going to go. <coughs> so go. Two plus four is six. He's going to charge. So he's got four inches minus two. So he gets in the base contact. I'll just put him up here. You can move over the dumpsters? It's difficult to read. I suppose. Climbing and going down. That's because they're like an objective. Oh, I, I see. Know. Well, I guess we never declared that. I'm just going to put him right here. So he made it in there. Well, that means the assassin would have to move over more. That means he'd have to be in base contact. Yeah, and there's a rule for that. It says if you can get into base contact, but you can't physically place no, him I mean, there. No, I mean with your other models. I understand what you mean. He's infected. Oh, that's right. <laughs> is it when they activate, or is it when they get the base contact? That's the very last part. Are you right? Yeah, I don't care about getting base contact with me. <laughs> Any human or animal model that starts his activation of base contact, or moves into base contact with the model, will hit. So it's not until they activate next turn. Oh, okay. So I've got overrun. Because I charged, so if I kill him, I can then leave. <laughs> <laughs> but he failed. So nice guy. No, no, he made it. There. Oh, the oh, that guy is overrun. That's right. Because yeah, yeah, because yeah. I charged. Right, right. Only because I charged. I forgot. Got a recruiter. It's Thirteen. Rule. So it's six or less again to hit. No command points left. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Fiddlesticks. Oof, oof. Well, you're like surrounded. <laughs> oh. oh, imagine if I had two assassins. <laughs> So hard to hit without command points. Oh, I'm like, I'm going to destroy him this round, <clears throat> and then we'll be done. Well, you got your snipers left. So he's going to advance right here, and he's going to heal. He makes it, so he's healed. And then flame launcher guy. Oh, these flames are gone. Mm -hmm. Launcher guy. Well, he's still got three command points. Yep. <laughs> Can my sniper see him? He can. Uh oh. And so can he. Uh oh. Yeah, but I want to. Uh, I'm not going to be able to kill you this round. I thought I was going to. No He's problem. got his really good armor against snipers, Sorry. but they also can overpower their shot when they. Yeah. If they roll really well. He's also got a high defense. Not killing your commander. <laughs> okay, I'm going to do my snipers right now against your commander. Oh, he's totally going to fail. <laughs> they both have one command point. He's got level one cover from both of them. Oh, but they're passing over a gravity mine. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Both of them are. So that's mine under minus two. Well, that's a well-placed gravity mine. <laughs> yeah, like I planned... perfectly in their line. I definitely planned that one out. Or just got lucky. <laughs> uh, that was my uh, instincts falling uh, out. Commanders, defense four, only two. <laughs> then on top of that, it will be another minus two. That's two, four, eight. That's all I'm Two, three, four, five, minus four, so it'll be nine against their 14. So bring down to five or less. That's not that bad. But then I have to wound. They only have one command point each. <laughs> against this guy, it'll still be, yeah, see, minus two and minus two, and then one cover, so it'll be three, so it'll be minus eight. So it's actually easier to hit him. I'm going to go for him. Okay. But he does have his ballistic armor. Yeah, I know. Okay. <clears throat> okay. I'm hoping to get lucky at the roll. Yeah. So, so minus eight, so six or less to hit. Okay. Six. Ooh. Mm. <clears throat> I'll have to roll one to wound you. I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> oh! 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 D oh. three wounds. Oh, I only have two wounds left. Yeah. Oh, you still have a command point. I do. <laughs> oh, no. Unless I roll a one. Yeah. And oh. a two. I use a command point to make it a three. He's oh. gone. Oh, and all his command points are gone. Yep. Oh, nasty. Add to the command point pile. Oh, come on. Let's say I got lucky to finish you off. Get lucky at the beginning, lucky at the end. <laughs> Little snipers. Another one will fire. Yeah, I think gravity mine has protected both of them. Other one will fire. You can fire at your own commander. Why would I want to do that? Uh, you we never would want to, ever. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to fire at the infector. Okay. Because he's just annoying and infecting everybody. 
and uh, yeah, might as well. Oh, he's not spreading. He's not a very good infector. <laughs> he's also contagious, so if he gets into base contact with somebody, he can infect. He infects them too. So oh, minus two, oh. minus four, minus the cover, so minus five, and then he's minus so minus eight, six or less as well. Okay. Oh, nine. Reroll. Nine. <laughs> That's what's supposed to happen. <laughs> there you go. Okay, one quick question though, because you said if people move into base to base with an infected model. If they move into, not if he moves into their base. Right, so if I move, it, but then they start their activation beside him. Exactly. Gotcha. They start their activation or move into it. Okay. All right. So I got the flame launcher guy. And that's it. And I got the commando. Okay, flame launcher and commando. So commando will activate, take a strength two hit. It's fine. And he makes his leadership or his morale, so he's fine. And he's going to charge your commander. <laughs> in fact, was going blah. But it doesn't matter. These guys are <clears> dead <throat> next turn. Yeah, I'm going to charge your commander, tie him up, so that your electron master doesn't go around killing everybody. So I see charges. Maybe okay. if, I, if I get lucky, I won't be able to kill him because I can only hit him three times. Your commander's defense is four. Hits my close combat of 13. So nine or less. Possible three hits. Two hits. I will take that. Okay. Strike six against the commander's armor of four. So two or less. I will use my one command point to make one wound. So he's down to four wounds. He has a morale test, minus one. So eight or less. Oh. No command points. Oh. Oh no! <laughs> Boken. Uh oh. That's not good. Nope, not at all. <laughs> Nasty. Okay, and then Flame Launcher will activate. Uh huh. He will move forward. No, he's. He's gonna move around. Two, five. That way he's not in base contact with the medic who you're going. Well, actually, he's immune. Is the medic immune? Yeah, he is, so you can't infect him anyways. So you actually can't hurt the infect or the medics with your regular gun. Hmm. But he has a plasma blaster, so he can shoot that. Gotcha. So he's gonna fire at him. So minus one. And then minus his defense of three, so minus four. So ten or less. Oh. Easy, Hit. easy. So flame. <clears throat> strength seven. Not multiple wounds though. Oh. So four or less. Got it. So he's wounded. And the two, and he has to take a morale test minus one, so he's broken. So you have to use your own morale, <laughs> which is six, seven. Oh, you're fine. And that's it. All right, I so regenerating. Come you got, got one, one on the assassin. And then one on the infector. One on the infector. All right, what and are you going to do? That's it? That's all you have. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I think you've lost. The question is how much can you kill before you die? <laughs> yeah, and you're in base to base. So I can't even run up and try to get a point. <clears throat> so he's gonna move out of the flames. Good idea. Actually, wait, wait. So he can move three, another inch and a half, right there. And then Kablammy. And then Kablammy. Which one is he targeting? Um. He has a lower defense. Him, yeah. And they both get hit by the same strength, so you might as well choose him. So close range, no cover, <clears throat> defense of four. From your, so ten or less. You got it. They both get hit. Right. Strength three, no armor. So let's do the, the launcher first. Yeah, it's cocked. Try again. Oh. What was it? Four or less? Three or less. Oh, okay. It's cocked. Well, thank you. He got him, and then the recruiter. He got him. So they're both infected, and they both take a wound. All right. You only really had to infect one, though, because then the other one would activate in base contact. <laughs> <laughs> so morale tests. Uh, we'll do, they're both simultaneous. Recruiter first, seven or less. Fails, he does not have any command points. Oh. So he's broken. And the other guy still gets to use oh. his because that happened simultaneous and he makes his. Of course, he's the one with the command point. <laughs> so my recruiter's broken. That sucks. Huh. All right, keep going. All right. Oh, yeah, command. No, command doesn't. He didn't regenerate. Get any. Darn it. Okay, so my close combat is sucks. only 11. Minus 4 for fleeing. So 7 minus my 6 defense. You have to roll <laughs> double ones to hit. Ah, oh, you've done enough. I should be able to do it. Nope. Okay, now try to regroup him. Nine or less. He's good, so he's no longer broken. Okay. But, oh yeah. And then your assassin. <clears throat> All right. Which one is he going to slice to pieces? Um, who do I want to slice? I'm going to slice My commando is hurt. this guy. Well, uh, but your commando's harder to hit. 
Yes, he is. But he only has two more wounds left. That's right. No, I'm going to attack this guy. Yeah, okay. His defense is four, so uh, ten or less. So it's two hits. Oh. You could use the one to make it three hits. Yep, making it three hits. Okay, and then it's five or less, so don't roll sixes. <laughs> Sounds familiar? Yes. Ah, oh. oh, come on. Oh. <laughs> had to roll one of them. So he takes morale test minus two, so he's got the recruiter nearby, so six or less. Seven. No command points. So he's broken. So any little broken marker. I don't think we have any more. And then uh, I guess that's it. That's my turn. <clears throat> All right, so flame disappears. Regenerate. Recruiter's fleeing, so he doesn't get his. He already has his one. Two on the command, on the director. They've got theirs. He's fleeing, one on him, one on the commando, and then one on the recruiter. So I'll activate this medic. He's going to heal. Success. So he's back up to two. And that's all he'll do. The medic's actually really effective with the, with the solos. Yeah, they can keep him alive. Yeah, because he was already hurt. He, yeah. did, he was down, so he would be yeah. dead. Without he would have died without the, the, the medic. Yeah. And this medic will activate and heal the commander. <coughs> Fails and can't reroll because they rolled double six. Um. <coughs> I need to start. Have I killed any of your guys yet? My commando. I'm actually tempted to leave combat with my commando. Let you get a free strike on me so that I can sniper your guy. That's what he's going to do. Oh, you commando so, forgot to use a pistol too. Oh, that's right. I keep forgetting. I've used that, forgotten that the entire game. Yeah. <laughs> so. Uh, maybe I can shoot your guy before I run. Like, you can do use it anytime. <laughs> well, you can run and shoot, although if yeah, I get hit. And... Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna try to make you. Fl I'm gonna try to make you break. Okay. So I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use my free action before I move. First, you get hit by an infection. All right. Oh, I take a wound. Uh oh. Do I break? No. Oh. <laughs> okay. So now I'm gonna shoot you with a pistol in your face. Okay. So, Pew. command with 13 minus your defense of 4, so 9 or less. Oh, I fail it. <laughs> oh, he has a command point. I'm not going to waste it on that. He's going to leave combat, so you get a free strike on him. So it'll be your close combat 11 plus 2, down up to 13, minus his 6, so down to 7 or less. So that's uh, one hit, because I only have one attack. Yep. Probably should add one more to his attacks, but right now he only has one. And he's strength... Four, so three or less to wound. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oops. Yes. Oh, you kill him. <laughs> Whoa. Whoops. Who's in with six stitches? He's in line of sight. He's not broken. He is now. Oh, crap. <laughs> that backfired. <laughs> oh, well. I'll still snipe your guy. You probably will. With your st oh, yeah, you have your snipers. Yeah, that's why I was. You're like, I'm not like. I was thinking, oh yeah, you're gonna snipe him with people. I'm like, no, you're gonna snipe, snipe him. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'll move off with the. He's gonna go first. Uh, he's got two commands. Common dot here. Oh, he's got right, he's right. got infected though. I so guess. He <laughs> takes another wound. <laughs> he's down the one wound. Yeah, that's why I was trying to heal him. <laughs> See, this is the infector is very effective if you could play more than three rounds. Yeah. Yeah. Because over time, he'd be, everything would be dying. Okay, so he's gonna fire. He's gonna drop the. Rate of fire to get the extra strength, so you can do multiple wounds. Ooh. So there's no cover or anything. Nope. So and there's no range penalty. We're like four to hit. I mean, four, fourteen minus your yeah, ten or less. Got ya. So one single hit at strength eight minus your armor four, so four or less. Got gotcha. you. <laughs> D three wounds. Oh, you're down to one wound. Oh no. I didn't even have to use a command point. I know. All right, so make your morale minus three. Oh. Six or less. Oh, yeah, make it. <laughs> That's what I was about to kill you the old-fashioned way. <laughs> okay, flame launcher's gonna activate, take strength to hit, he's fine. Take some morale test, because he got hit, he's fine. But he's oh, no, he's already broken, so I didn't yeah. have to take that morale test. Didn't matter. And then he's going to fire his flame launcher, point blank range, at your uh -huh. guy. And so it'll be minus four, um, his defense, and defense uh, is three. It's so minus seven to his 14. Hey, direct hit. Oh. So that stays right there. No, I was hoping it would scatter back into you. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny. That's right there on top of him. Yeah. Strength seven against your armor of three. Three. So four or less. Oh, he doesn't have the command point anymore. 
Um, so that's a wound. So yep. you, have to, you have to take a morale on test. One. Minus one. So eight. Nine. So you have your command point to make that an eight. Yes. So there's no point not using a command point. Yes. Still, you guys are just about dead. And there's a flame <laughs> thing on him right now. Yes. Yes, there is. Can my sniper see him? He's trying to... Oh, no. So I have to kill him with somebody else. So the recruiter will go next. He takes the strength to hit. Oh, wait. Is this guy still broken? Yes. <laughs> recruiter will go next. Does he... Does not take a wound. He's already broken, so I don't have to roll his if he gets broken. And he fires. He's going to sacrifice <clears throat> range for rate of fire. So rate of fire three. Uh -huh. Still minus four. So it'll be down 14 down to 10, minus your. So seven or less. Oh no. Misses. Eight. Although he's got the commander nearby. Oh yeah, he's got the commander nearby when he rolled his command check. I don't remember if I made it or not. Doesn't matter. He's going to use his command points and uh, re roll. Oh, we roll, What eh? did I say I had to get? Seven. There, oh, two hits. nuts. <laughs> <laughs> These are strike five, though, so two or less. There we go. Oh. And your commander has to take another morale test, a normal morale. Oh, he makes it. He's, 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 he's going to hang in there. Now do I make my morale? Oh. And he uses other commands, so he's no longer fleeing. Or do you need nine? Oh, yeah, correct, because it's in. Cause oh, I got you, got you. Whew, this is pretty close. <sighs> These guys are all just dying from infection, and I can't heal him, so he might die next turn just on his own, but if you have anything left. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, flame launcher, fire at him after he moves up. Hello. So he's going to fire at him. Is it eight or six? Uh-oh. He's mi not minus one. Hey, sorry, there's no range band, but he's got this thing, so minus one. Here, so minus five, so nine or less. Hits, strength seven hit. Oh, no. Minus armor of four. Yeah. Gonna reroll. <laughs> oh, he survives! <laughs> I think we know who's gonna lose, but I just watched him. <laughs> I got Sniper! Take, oh, I take morale first. Alright. Oh, you make it! <laughs> okay. Sniper! I got this. We got this, guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be ridiculous. So, minus two range, minus one for the trees, yeah. and four, so minus seven. So, seven or less. Seven. Oh. oh, strength minus one. I don't have any command points on them. Why not? Yeah, I don't know. They didn't already fire, did they? No, they didn't. I just didn't give it to them. I'm going to keep that seven. So it'll be minus one strength. So it'll be strength five. So I have to roll. I have to roll a one. I'm gonna reroll that. Reroll. Six. So that's a hit. Strength six. So not much better. So two or less. Yeah. And then I die. Go. You're dead. I don't know why I'm excited. Obviously, you were good. <laughs> no! Now you're, yeah. <laughs> now you're assassin. It's like, whoo, that was close. All right, I'll start with the guy that's broken. Uh, he's got to roll like double ones. <laughs> okay, now I gotta calculate. What do we actually need to roll? <laughs> that's like the fifth time this game. I'm sorry. Close combat is 12, minus four for running, eight. But yeah, so you need double ones. So that's margin of success zero. <laughs> But you're only, so he's only strength four, but it's minus one armor, so three or less. Oh my goodness, he killed you. <laughs> he was oh. the one to kill you. <laughs> so basically, wow. the assassin comes up and goes, foom, foom, and he's like, oh my gosh, and he kills him <laughs> as he swings. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty much happened. And there is no more Zalanthos at all. Wow, that was a bad, bad game. Well. I'm sorry, people. People are like, oh, why do you post games that are so bad? It's because I just spent like three hours playing it. <laughs> <laughs> not going to work for three hours and not have a video to show. Also, I still think it teaches us some good things, which we'll talk about in a moment. Yeah. Oh, those darn snipers. They consistently did. Yeah. Oh, the, oh, the second Two turn, they didn't do too much. Might be too much for 50 points. Well, again, they were shooting against. You're right. It might be too much. Although they, they had a really lucky roll against got, the assassin. Yeah, that's true. And that was that's huge, huge. That, that maybe because imagine if I had two assassins in that group, and I wasn't rolling on really unlucky. Yeah, you'd have <laughs> like I would like kill two solos per turn. Yeah. So there's that. Then also, yeah, I think it was just a bit of an unlucky game for the Atlantis. I I think overall it was a lot of good dice rolling on my part, and you didn't. I don't think you did particularly bad in your dice rolls. I don't think you did particularly well either. So I did, no. I did particularly well, and you didn't do particularly well. So that kind of unbalanced it. But I think the corporation all solo army against the Xanthos, mostly solo army, is mm -hmm. unbalanced. 
because you don't have access to all the cool stuff that I can do yet. And those Antho troops are stronger than Yeah, when you bring in the troops, the they're troops. quite effective. So, scenario, no idea if it's any good. It seems <laughs> it's pretty straightforward. Those well, objectives. I think it's pretty good because look, it forced us to run up to each other. That's true. Like, everything is in the middle. Yeah, Normally exactly. It's There's a strip, except for two snipers. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they can shoot from everywhere. I only have a 90 degree arc in the one corner of a square board. <laughs> oh, so only everywhere. Yeah. So yeah, it kind of turned out in my favor that way too. So I think that I won partly because of composition, but that's mm -hmm. availability of what I had. Partly because of lucky rolls. And then those are the two reasons, yeah. I hope that you enjoyed this playtest. Obviously the scenario wasn't really playtested. Mm -hmm. We'll have to do that again. We'll do a lot more playtest. And we didn't really get to play test the smoke grenades to see if the new change was good. We'll have I to didn't do, need them. You just slotted me. <laughs> I'll have to. I'll have to do like you have a super superior ranged army, and I'll bring like spamming recruits or something, so that forces me to need the cover to advance in that way, or vice versa. Because I don't think I want to do that again. I'm kind of tired of that already. But I know somebody's going to, so I have to balance it. That's the problem. You have to like, <coughs> you have to plan for people to try to min max because you know there's going to be lots of people that do that. And also. I don't know if it's necessary. We don't know yet if the recruit, I mean, the the corporation solos are overpowered, like the way it is. Because what if I had brought units? What would be the difference? Yeah, exactly. Like it might, I might have been able to kill it. Just if you bring an all solo army as Zalanthos, it's not as strong as an all solo army in corporation. As For of, now, as as of now, well, three of my units have multiple wound weapons. Oh. Two snipers, and then the director has the option to switch it to a multiple wound. I'm thinking of making that for the electron master that can fire in two modes: the blast or a strength seven multiple wounds. I like that idea. Yeah, so we can like focus all the energy and and hurt the target more. So that might be a good way to balance that as well. It's also because we don't have more than one commander unit right now, mm -hmm. so there's only one choice. So maybe if there was like a couple war gear options, like you could swap out a couple little things. Not too much because it's. It's hard to balance that if you start having a lot of war gear. Because then there's a thing that you always bring, and mm -hmm. we don't want that to happen. The orc big mech with custom force field, like, you've got to bring that. <laughs> and the Doom of Malentai. I don't know, I haven't brought the custom force field in the last, like, five games I've played. I won four out of five. Yeah. <laughs> it's not for me. Okay, anyways, hope you enjoyed this playtest. If you have comments and you want to contribute to the growing of Dark Potential and all the ideas, there's a link below here to the Dark Potential forums. Make sure you post there your ideas and feedback. This is Matthew and Dan from Mini Wargaming. Happy Wargaming.